Hi, my name is Chris Melnick, and I'm a realtor in Halifax, Nova Scotia. This is five movies that were filmed in Nova Scotia. Number one, The Lighthouse in 2019 with Willem Dafoe and Robert Pattinson. This was filmed near Yarmouth at Cape Fortu, where they actually built their own 70-foot lighthouse. This is fairly ironic because Nova Scotia has the most lighthouses out of any state or province, yet they couldn't quite find the one that they wanted for the movie. Number two, K-19 The Widowmaker in 2002, with Harrison Ford and Liam Neeson. Now, most scenes were filmed inside a submarine, but some scenes were filmed at the Halifax shipyard. And what's even cooler is that it was about 50 Halifax shipyard workers who added 50 tons of steel to make a Soviet Juliet-class submarine look like a larger Soviet hotel-class submarine for the movie. Number 3, My Bloody Valentine in 1981. This was filmed in Sydney Mines, which was a stand-in for the fictional Canadian mining town of Valentine's Bluff in the movie. The real mine itself was closed in 1975. The production team had chosen the location because it looked like it was in the middle of nowhere. And funny enough, prior to production, the owners cleaned it up to a point where it looked too nice. So production painted everything again to make it look dreary. Number 4, Titanic in 1997. Yes, one of the greatest movies of all time had some scenes that were filmed just off the coast of the Halifax Harbor. These were some of the present-day open water scenes, so the ones with Bill Paxton. There are also a whole bunch of other connections to the Titanic, both the real ship and the movie to Halifax, including a now-confirmed story of how someone spiked the chowder with PCP after their final day of filming in Dartmouth which sent many crew members, including James Cameron and Bill Paxton, to the Halifax ER. And number five, Amelia in 2009. This movie about Amelia Earhart with Hilary Swank, Richard Gere, and Ewan McGregor had some scenes that were filmed around Acadia University in Wolfville and in the Halifax Harbor. Funny enough, in this scene, you can actually still see the writing on the building that says St. Mary's Boat Club. Anyways, if you found Nova Scotia so interesting that you want to move here and buy a house, feel free to contact me. My contact information is in the description. Goodbye.